Gus just reflecting back on last week, what do you make of it now? I, no, it's very similar to immediately after the game, we played well, especially second half. We, we created good chances, we scored two goals early, but you know, ultimately we, we don't take the three points, something that was out with our control, uh, and that was disappointing, but we've, we can't do anything about it, you know, we've just got to focus on tomorrow's game. As you say, Montrose tomorrow, what do you make of the game going into? Yeah, it's, it's a difficult game. Um, Montrose, a very good good team. We experienced that last year in the two legs. Um, we lost narrowly at Montrose and then we were able to salvage you know, the, the tie and get through with a uh, very late goal um, at Carpolo. Um, but we're challenged tomorrow. We've got players missing you know, for various reasons. We've got the, the two lads, Ocean and Jacoby, and under 21 international duty, we've got injuries to Gozzi, um Alexander Easdale and Brian McLean. So we're challenged you know, in terms of the, the, the squad, but we'll see it all the time. You know, it just becomes the opportunity for, for players to go and play. You mentioned the two games last season in the playoffs. Does having those two games previously help in preparation at all? No, not really, because we've got a completely different squad as it is anyway. So um, I'm sure the players that have been there Played and are you know, still here, we'll be able to remind you know the new new boys that they are a good team and you know to expect a tough game. But we'll we'll make a few changes as well. You know, some enforced on us and some to actually get a, the younger ones get experience of it as well. How has preparation been? And how's it been the camp? Yeah, it's been good. Um, it's just really been a normal week. It's we've been down bodies because uh, players have been away and injuries, of course. But you know. The, the group have trained well, um, and, and another one that's missing as well, we've got to mention as well, is Chris Wiley, um, who's, who's decided to, to leave and go and further his education at university, so we wish him well. Um, but it leaves us in a little bit of a situation as well, but it's, it's again, so there's challenges there for the players as well. Um, but they've trained well, and just preparation you know, for the game you know, takes care of itself.